Hello, and welcome to our daily reflections on the Bible on Wednesday the 29th of April. Our readings today are in front of you. If you have time, try to read them now. Our passage in John continues the sermon that we've been reading for the last two days to crowds following Jesus because they thought he might give them food. The central point of his sermon is that if they only believe in him, becoming his followers in spirit as well as in body, then he can give them much more than bread. He can give them salvation. It comes with this remarkable promise that Jesus will lose nothing of all that God has given him. This promise might have been pondered by the believers in our passage in Acts as the aftermath of the death of Stephen turns into a full-blown persecution. The believers are being seized from their own homes and many are forced to flee Jerusalem. But God does not abandon them and this persecution actually speeds the spread of the gospel. In Acts chapter 1, Jesus commissioned the apostles to take the good news to Jerusalem, all Judea and Samaria, and to the ends of the earth. Here, as they are being driven out of Jerusalem because of their witness there, they are fulfilling that commission. Jesus has not lost one of those that his Father gave him. Our psalm sings the praise of God. He is awesome in his deeds among mortals. It doesn't matter what comes against him. He will prevail. As part of his church, that is something for us to remember too. Jesus will lose nothing of what God entrusted to him, and this includes us. So make a joyful noise to the Lord, and sing the glory of his name.